It was the night of Fat Tuesday, and everyone partied by eating and drinking and dancing and singing, but only till midnight, because at midnight it would be Ash Wednesday, the start of Lent. A rich man named Monsieur Latulipe and his wife hosted a giant party. They were in part celebrating their daughter's coming engagement to Gabrielle Lepas, a quiet and tranquil gentleman. But Rose, on the other hand, was a little bit too flirty. She had a lot of nice dresses and beautiful jewels, and she loved to be admired by others. Over the course of the night, she danced with every man except for her fiancé, who was left alone in a corner. A little after 11 o'clock, a strange man dressed completely in black arrived at the house. Monsieur Latulipe gave him permission to enter, and the stranger went directly to Rose and started to dance. Rose, flattered, graciously accepted the invitation. Time passed as they danced, and all of a sudden the clock was striking midnight. The stranger tempted Rose into continuing to dance. She was becoming more and more pale, and she started to fall and faint. At the last minute, a priest arrived from Chloridorm and walked straight to the couple. He made the sign of the cross and yelled, Back, Satan, as he held out his beads. At that moment, there was a thunderclap and an odor of sulfur, and the devil disappeared. Rose was sick for months, and when she got better, she decided she would become a nun. Disappointed, Gabriel would always wait for his Rose la Tulipe and never married anyone else. And the moral of the story is, don't be a flirt.